ladies and gentlemen, the crew delay has, has elapsed and Captain Tramontana is arriving now. Ladies and gentlemen, the man in the hour has finally arrived. We got his blood alcohol content below the legal limit to fly the flight. So, straight from the friendly stars, please welcome Captain Mickey Tromontana. Anyway, 
Uh, you know, you also, you guys get to do layovers. Yeah, that's, that's, pretty, that's pretty good. Yeah. You know, past tense of lay is laid. Yeah. Just, just say. Yeah. Uh, Sharon was a flight attendant when you met her, wasn't she? Yes, a layover. <laughs> Friendly skies. So, anyway. Okay. Uh, you know, a, a colleague of yours, the pilot, was just arrested a few weeks ago for operating brothels in Houston. Is that right? That's correct. And, and you know him? Yes. And I think you told me he was very happy in his work. He seemed very happy. All the time. Well, you know, that, that story really answered a question I've had for more than 30 years flying in the airline industry. And that is why they call where you sit in the plane the cockpit. <laughs> okay. So, uh, do you know what the favorite airline pilot joke is? No. So, what have you been doing for 35 years? <laughs> well, you know, during the research for this, I found out that the favorite airline. Pilot joke is. What's the difference between a jet engine and a flight attendant? Any idea? Well, yes, but I careful. <laughs> yes, but I couldn't say in this room. Good answer. <laughs> well, at the end of a flight, a jet engine stops whining. <laughs> I'll let you and Sharon discuss that later. So anyway. Okay, so. Speaking of flight attendants, you've had a lot of crews over 35 years. And for this retirement flight, we put together a very special crew. And they're here to express to you just how fine a pilot you are.
pretty sexy stuff there, Cap. Yeah? You get that all the time on your flights? Relax and enjoy the flight. 